That's right, everyone. Welcome to the Influencer Apocalypse. Today, we shall see women objectifying themselves on social media. Brace yourselves. Clap, clap, snap. Clap, 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 snap. This trio decided to waste their time watching the circus performers dance and work rather than looking for work to support their families. I mean, uh, the circus performers spend their entire lives honing their skills, their abilities. You know, uh, circus acrobat performers are more captivating and breathtaking to watch rather than these girls are twerking on a camera. Take a look at the nasty smile of this guy, like a hungry wolf hiding in a background. I mean, look at this. What is the meaning of this? This is like mental behavior that requires immediate medical attention. This woman will become a grandmother at some point and their grandkids will see this on a social media platform. Seeing that their grandmother showing their stuff in front of some strangers and for the sake of views and likes, they are not afraid of showing skin and asses, not knowing that they are being watched by perverts, pedophiles and adult sex offenders, not realizing that kids and minors have access to gadgets and internet as well. Why do they always say stop objectifying us and then when they ask why someone hook up with you and they default to my ass is fat, my teeth are big, make it sense, please explain to me why it's okay for them to objectify themselves right? It's insane, it's super empowering right? The sexual revolution, sexually empowered modern woman, it's okay to plant your body. No, it's more than okay. But the moment a man objectifies them too, they go, you disgusting pig, how dare you look at me like I'm a piece of meat? Social media has its advantage and disadvantage as well. It gives us ability to get connected and learn tons of information. Regrettably, some narcissists and degenerates took advantage of it as well. Nothing to offer but pain and destruction to our society. What a legacy to leave behind. <laughs> to depart from the servant of God.